One day after the protests at the proposed Islamic Cultural Center near Ground Zero, it was much quieter, in part due to police barricades that now cordon off the block. And the man in the middle of the controversy was speaking about it. I'm a man of peace dedicated to peace. In an interview with ABC News, Imam Faisal Abdul Rauf said a decision on changing the location is complicated. My major concern with moving it is that the headline in the Muslim world will be Islam is under attack in America. This will strengthen the radicals in the Muslim world. In the latest polls, some 7 out of 10 New Yorkers say the Islamic Cultural Center should be moved. Far different from when the public first learned of plans to develop the center last December. In a New York Times article describing the plans then, the imam was quoted as saying, we want to push back against the extremists. A spokesman for the 9-11 memorial called it positive. And the mother of a man killed on 9-11 described the plans as a noble effort. Well, we certainly had reached out. No one objected. He seems, by his actions, to be more interested in confrontation than in healing. Today, uh, former New York City Mayor Rudy point Giuliani point. compared the cultural center with the Florida minister's threat to burn the Koran. The imam has a right to put the mosque there. Freedom of religion gives him that right. The minister has the right to burn the Koran. A real dedication to healing that these men of God uh, would theoretically have would tell you not to do it because you're hurting too many people. Tom Kane, who chaired the 9-11 Commission, says a discussion is important but is concerned uh, about its tone. People, there were Muslim Americans killed on 9-11 in the World Trade Center. Uh, this is seven million people in our country, loyal Americans. But that's gotten lost in this discussion, hasn't it? It cannot get lost, because when it does, we play into the terrorist hands. That's what they want. They want this division. They want hate. Cain says what's needed is more reason and less passion. The question going forward, how much of each will mark the debate? Jim Axelrod, CBS News, New York.